right, so we're up here making some turns on Big Dipper today, and uh, today I want to talk to you about weight distribution uh, between your feet. Now, this question's been coming up a lot lately uh, while well, I've been certifying courses and teaching the public, and people are saying, well, should I be 50-50 on my feet, or is it 80-20? And my contention, or my belief, is that you've got to be 100% committed to the outside foot in order to resist the forces in skiing and ski efficiently. So today I'm going to give you a couple ideas on how to perfect that sensation. So in order to resist forces when traveling in an arc, you need to work to the outside of the turn. You perhaps have been in your vehicle when you've turned the vehicle a little too sharp and you feel that the outside tires bite harder, uh, the suspension might sink to the outside, maybe even your sunglasses that were sitting on the dash flew to the outside of the corner, right? So all that tells me is that that's where the grip is, that's where the purchase is. So when I'm skiing, I like to stand on my outside foot, very similar to that situation. So the drill we're going to try today is called the javelin turn. And what you're going to do is lift your inside ski up as early as you can in the turn and actually point that ski tip to the outside like this. Right? So it's going to keep you balanced in the direction of the force and get you to commit to the outside ski that has all of the grip. Let's take a look at what that looks like. Lift the ski up, point to the outside, and then turn. Right? And the idea here is that it sets the body up to face the force as well as commits me to the outside ski nice and early. All right? So the ski becomes very, very efficient, very, very powerful. It's a great sensation. Uh, even talking with uh, Manny Osborne Paradis from the Canadian national team, he was telling me he warms up with javelin turns every morning. Uh, just to set himself up to face force, to feel strong in the outside foot, and then he's ready. It's game day and he's ready to do it. So let's take one more look at that. That out, you can see the same patterns. Balance to the outside, commitment to the outside foot. There it is, okay? It's very easy to kind of hide the drill to keep the skill, all right? So again, good early commitment to the outside foot. The mass is facing to the outside where force is trying to pull me. And man, the skiing feels really, really good. So give it a try out there next time, javelin turn. And I think it'll really help your warm up and set you up for a great day on the snow. So on behalf of Panorama Mountain Village and Ski Canada Magazine, I'm Jason Simpson. I certainly hope that makes your skiing a little bit better. Take care.